one. Wayne, I want to hold you five minutes in the next hour, so we have two more little five-minute segments with you. But I'm going to ask this question okay. now. We're going to reconnect via regular phone with you because your Skype's breaking up too much uh, when we go to break here in about a minute. But before we do that, let me just pose the question now, and you can think about it during the break. Uh, we have the White House regulations are saying arrest people that disagree with the government, uh, infiltrate their groups, cognitive dissonance, set them up. Uh, two weeks ago, Politico gets the uh, memos uh, from uh, last year inside of Media Matters. George Soros group saying we're going to destroy the alternative media, starting with Fox News. I think that's popular and other sites critical of the administration. We're going to guerrilla warfare, destroy them. Uh, so this is a very scary group here. So who do you think they're going to send after you? A Chicago Mafia? A CIA hitman? I mean, what quarters do you think this, um, you know, them knocking you on the head or giving you a shot and then holding you up and putting that putting that tourniquet around your neck? Uh, I mean, folks, they'll do it. They'll kill him better than a hammer and they'll send a message to everybody. I mean, they'll kill me. I mean, I, let me tell you, folks, that's a real possibility. The U.S. economy is at a tipping point. Forty cents of every dollar the government spends is borrowed. The president of the Federal Reserve in Dallas was recently quoted saying, this path will lead to insolvency, resulting in the collapse of our government and our economy. Our country can't function like this, and neither can your household. That's why you need to prepare, and priority one is your food supply. Fortunately, it's easy and affordable with the help of Ready Reserve Foods. Ready Reserve Foods has been a premier supplier of long-term storable foods for 37 years. Their unique process assures the highest quality long-term food storage available with a 25-year shelf life. A full-year supply of quality food for two people costs a fraction of what you pay at the grocery store. For a free, full-color catalog, call 800-453-2202. That's 800-453-2202. Or visit readyreservefoods.com. Ready Reserve Foods, making preparedness simple since 1972. Hello, friends. This is Alex Jones. The earthquake, tsunami, and nuclear disaster that killed thousands of Japanese citizens is nothing compared to the devastation that could be caused by hyperinflation that will soon hit the United States and could lead to millions of Americans becoming homeless, all caused by the devalued U.S. dollar. While the mainstream media continues to ignore inflation, our friends at the National Inflation Association provide a free weekly newsletter that educates Americans to the facts and truth about the U.S. economy and inflation. I urge you to sign up at the NIA's free newsletter at www.inflation.us to learn how you can not only survive, but prosper during the upcoming hyperinflation crisis. Silver has more than doubled since the NIA declared silver the best investment for the next decade on inflation.us. The NIA's team of expert economists are happy to answer any economic questions you have about inflation, debt, currencies, real estate, precious metals, and commodities. Visit inflation.us to learn the economic truth that the mainstream media ignores. Most of us eat a blend of processed, man-made, and all-natural food. But the food you eat may not provide all the nutrition your body needs. We now know that liquid vitamin supplements are absorbed faster than pills. That's why you need Sea Energy. From AffinitySeaEnergy.com, sea vegetation is known to be the richest source of organic minerals. And that's what you'll find in all-natural, great-tasting Sea Energy. Sea Energy contains aloe vera, black cherry, cranberry, and pomegranate juices, plus ginseng, cat's claw, ginger, ginkgo biloba, and over 50 trace minerals needed for healthy metabolism, all from natural organic sea plant sources. Get a 10% discount by using promo code GCN at checkout when you order Sea Energy from AffinitySeaEnergy.com. Call 855-732-3637. That's 855-732-3637. Or go to AffinitySeaEnergy.com today. You know, it's creepy when I had to travel to cities and turn off the light in my own hotel room. I'll be honest, sometimes we have people following us. I go ahead and barricade the door uh, just so I have a fighting chance. But they can kill you. I mean, look at Mubarak. He wouldn't step down. He has a stroke. Uh, then he's in the trial and has a heart attack. Uh, in the death threats we've gotten, they want you to know it's the government. It'll be a, It'll show no number. And they'll when they death threat you... They'll act nice at first, but then start telling you something that you just had in a phone conversation 10 minutes before. 
And, and, you know, they'll say, this has happened, I don't know, six, seven, eight times over the years. Now you know who we are, don't you? Because I told you that. Now I'm going to kill you. You understand that? You're dead. And they'll say it in a really mean voice. This is who runs America. And you understand they're going to take your pension funds. They're going to start new wars. They're going to destroy everything. The country's over if we don't have courage. we got to stand up to these people. I'm risking my life. Wayne is. Ron Paul is. You better believe. Stand beside us, folks, not behind us. We're going to beat these people. We don't have a choice. Somebody has got to stand up to them. Uh, Wayne, uh, we went to break there. I brought up the admissions of the White House regulations are of COINTELPRO and how great it is. The bizarre memos out of uh, George Soros's Media Matters about guerrilla warfare against alternative media. The people at Media Matters who listen every day and, and write about the show every few days, those, those interns listening, they need to understand they, they're going to end up, if we get victory against them, going down like Nixon's people. Well, that's right. And, and I have to say that uh, I, have, I have seen how uh, almost every group, including those who supposedly protest the Obama administration, have been totally infiltrated. The anti-war movement, uh, some of these other uh, groups, uh, some of these uh, privacy organizations, civil liberties organizations, all infiltrated, all with Soros money for the most part. And, um, uh, I mean, it makes the Nixon's enemies list look like, uh, you know, a shopping, uh, a shopping list. Wayne, uh, when are you planning to leave the United States? Well, without getting into details, it's not, and it's not easy to just pick up after being here for so long to go elsewhere, but um, it, it, it will be in the next... Uh, Next few uh, weeks, uh, maybe a, a month or so. Is there any part of your investigation in Chicago or into his CIA uh, grooming background? Do you have any intel you haven't released uh, that you can get out here now that will lessen the chances of them whacking you? Well, um, I, all I can say is uh, there's a, we, we know that uh, ex-Governor Blagojevich's trial uh, begins the end of this month in Chicago. There's a lot of information that the, uh, the prosecutors are suppressing. I think it'll show uh, what was really going on in, inside Chicago uh, politics with uh, the, the Olympics, trying to get the Olympics uh, scam. And who was going to benefit from that? Valerie Jarrett, Michelle Obama, uh, the, the, uh, the late head of the school board, Michael Scott, who was found dead in the Chicago River with a bullet in his head, which has still not been resolved as a, as a uh, suicide by the Chicago PD. Uh, that, I think, is what we're going to find a, a, in addition to some of the seamier sides of Obama and Rahm Emanuel's past. What about CIA background with Obama? You must be getting close if they're after you. Well, I think that's what's got them uh, more uh, concerned than anything else. Um, I've been going, especially Ann Stanley, Stanley Ann Dunham, his uh, mother. I mean, it was quite clear that uh, her whole history was invented. She was not some uh, flower child, uh, hippie, bohemian type. Uh, she was... Uh, a, a, a graduate of the University of Hawaii in anthropology and is immersed in post uh, a, a coup Indonesia where they they killed 800,000 to a million people courtesy of the military. She was a minion the of the big foundations and Geithner's papa. Ford Foundation, the uh, World Bank, uh, you name it. She was in all those. Never was on food stamps in her entire life. Yeah, she was above CIA level, actual globalist management level. Back in one minute with Wayne Madsen. Stay with us. Thank you for listening to GCN. Visit GCNlive.com today. Over the last year, Alex has told you about, and many of you have experienced, emergencies and disasters in unprecedented numbers. People have had to literally run for their lives. Folks, this is Steve Shank with eFoods Direct. I'm not here to scare you, but when disaster strikes, you won't have time to think. You must act automatically. What does a pilot do when the helicopter engine fails in flight? 
No time to think, just act automatically. When the alert is broadcast, the alarm sounds, or the knock comes on your door, you'll need to be ready to act without thinking of what to do or what you need. You need a five-day extreme emergency kit. With serious supplies and real food to secure two adults for five days, this powerful $300 extreme emergency kit is free with an order of at least $995 from eFoods Direct. Go to eFoodsDirect.com slash Alex or call 800 800- 409-5633. That's eFoodsDirect.com slash Alex. 800-409-5633. Coast to coast, direct from Austin. You're listening to the Alex Jones Broadcasting Network. Network. <laughs> All right, doing a f- final five minutes with uh, Wayne Madsen, investigative journalist, WayneMadsenReport.com. And uh, he's had a particularly bad Skype and phone line today, uh, and he just dropped. We're getting him back on for a final few questions uh, here. He has said that he is getting ready to leave the United States. And for somebody who hasn't gotten government death threats, where they let you know they're listening to your phones and tell you things you were talking about five minutes before, ten minutes before, before they threaten you. You know, at that point, you're just like, I can't live in fear. I just got to go all out against you people. And I don't even really look over my shoulder. I don't want to die. I love life so much. I love my children more than life itself. But it is what it is. Somebody's got to commit against these people. Somebody has got to have the courage to say no to the New World Order. Somebody has got to realize just how serious these globalists are and that they're totally ruthless. I mean, America is being turned into one giant FEMA camp with the children trained to have the government molesting them, to have the parents trained to turn their kids over, the government taking blood samples from babies at birth, now admittedly for close to four decades. It it just has to end. It has to stop. We've got to at least slow it down. But instead of slowing it down, what's happening is there's a huge awakening happening And the globalists are just putting things into high gear. They are putting the entire system into high gear. We got Wayne back. We only got about three minutes. Wayne Madsen, anything else you'd like to add? Anything else you're you're uh, looking into? uh, You know, dealing with these uh, direct, you know, major media telling you and the State Department telling you. Look, the word is they want you dead. I mean, clearly they wanted this message to get to you that, that they are planning to kill you. Well, I, I, of course, did a sanity check on myself and ran this by some very close colleagues of mine who are journalists. And, I, you know, I let them know uh, what the source was, and they were, you know, really concerned and upset uh, that, you know, uh, they said, you have to take that seriously. So, I mean, uh, it's not just something that was passed over the transom uh, uh, as a uh, uh, sort of an idle threat. Um, I, I did bet this with others who kind of urged me to, you know, take it seriously and, um, of course, uh, do the right thing. So um, I think I think just that Washington is not a good place to be right now. Uh, there's no access for independent journalists. There's no, um, there, there's, the sources are drying up. It, it, it's almost like covering uh, a politics in Pyongyang, North Korea here now. Wayne, are we going to be able to get you back up in the next few weeks before you leave the country? Oh, absolutely. Well, maybe we should get you on a good phone line and have you for a full hour. Or before okay. you leave the country, you're welcome to come down here to Austin and be in studio with us. We might even be able to, in fact, we, we will. If you want, we'll buy you a plane ticket and put you up here for two or three days. Uh, maybe you can be our uh, in-studio analyst for a couple days. You want to, after, you, sure. after you move out of your apartment or box everything up or whatever you're planning, you want to come down to Austin? Absolutely. I'd be happy to do that. Well, we've got to hang together or certainly hang separate. And our founding fathers went through similar things. They had British death warrants out on their heads. And John Hancock, knowing they'd come after his land, his family, he signed his name the biggest at the top. And he said, if I'm going to be on the list, I want to be on the top of the list. Absolutely. <laughs> but but doesn't this in closing signify that, that they're scared, they're desperate, they're not invincible? Oh, I think so. The thing is, they're doing damage control now. They... They don't want any surprises coming out because the, the smart money is on Obama getting reelected uh, because we see this, uh, you know, the circus on the other side. Uh, 
Uh, and, and so that's where all the smart Wall Street money is. Four more years of Obama to carry out their agenda, which he's doing quite, quite nicely and has been. Uh, and we'll hear more about that with his speech tonight. That's right. He's announcing a new tax code to help us. Boy, I, uh, this, is, this is help we don't need, Wayne. Absolutely. And, and the devil uh, will uh, be in the details, I'm sure. Wayne, while we have you, I'm going to put you on hold here at the end of this segment. We're going to go ahead and look at the book next week and uh, look for the time to get you on and maybe give us off record a ballpark of when, uh, when you uh, leave town. Maybe you can make a stop through Austin uh, so we can uh, physically interview you here. I know we've gone to D.C. to interview you before, but uh, God bless you. We'll all pray for you. Support him at WayneMansonReport.com. Jay Smith for Newswatch Magazine. Did you know that Russian fighter jets have joined with Venezuela in training? Did you know that the Russian destroyers held training exercises?